Yo, what's going on YouTube? Chrono here and welcome back to the channel. So today we're actually live over on Twitch bright and early because we've got some new content to try out. That just means that we've got another update video for you guys. But if you're new to the channel, as always, I'm Chrono. I primarily cover PSO2 content. Would much appreciate the subscribers work our way towards that 10K mark, hopefully by the end of this year. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump into this. So as far as content goes for us to cover, this is a decent amount. I haven't really grabbed everything ahead of time like I usually do. I'm not sure why I didn't this time around, but let's just be real. I didn't. <laughs> so let's go ahead and pull it up here in case you guys are someone who is new to these videos, isn't sure how this is done or, or why anyone would even watch this in the first place. You guys are more than welcome to always grab this information yourselves. Basically, we just go through everything together. I'll let you guys know what's kind of important, what may not be important, my reactions to certain things. And uh, you can decide if it's something you wanted to toss up in the background from now on, or if you want to gather this information on your own, though you guys don't have to listen to me talk. Totally up to you ultimately, but when we grab the update details, we've got, let's see, I'll go for another world collab campaign. Super dope. Uh, the new AC scratch as well. I'm actually pretty excited for this collab scratch. So, and then uh, we're going to read through these at some point. We'll grab the events and campaigns uh, listing as well. So yeah, that should be everything we need. It's probably update details. Now, if there's going to be anything as far as patch notes, you'll find them right down here. As you can see, there is nothing listed here. Yesterday, there was something listed because it was there for the previous weeks. But since it's this week, they update it. This link will always take you to whatever the current week is, and it starts out with Sign of the Planet Breaker. So this is a four-man quest. It's going to be a highly difficult quest. It's the reason that we are live this early in the morning. A Dark Falls class enemy, a Dark Falls class Starless, is here and is going to mess us up. Um, they mentioned tune up your gear. It's going to be fairly difficult and expect to be absolutely obliterated. So I'm pretty excited to give this a shot. We don't really have a designated party uh, to run this with. That really hasn't been my thing. So we'll have to see how that goes. But uh, yeah, I'm actually excited to check this out. I don't foresee this being puggable content or, or pugs doing super well. I mean, granted, anything's really puggable if you get the right people together. But what really decides being puggable? Anyway, um, we also have uh, it looks like Geometric Labyrinth Rank 2 Solo and Trinity Toss is available for all classes. I really wish they would separate this by class. Of course, it's all classes available, but hopefully it's separated by class. And if it's not, they really need to go back to doing that. Because if not, then it's just going to be Braver and Slayer at the top for the most part. We have Uncle Another World. I got some pretty cool outfits. I'm actually looking forward to this camo. It looks pretty dope. Oh, that camo is actually really good, too. It's like a scythe. That's actually pretty awesome. A lot of the Sega stuff is going to be really good as well. Um, and that is it on the update details. We've got this new quest and we have Uncle Another World. Pop over to the Uncle Another World scratch. We can see what the campaign is going to be about. People have really told me this anime is good, so I'm going to actually sit down and watch it, but I haven't yet. I really want to, though. The login bonus is going to give us some... What is this? These are... BP. What does BP stand for again, chat? Is this a... So you can paste in the world, or is this specifically for your uh, creative space? No, creative space would see would see or would be CS, not BP. So oh, we forgot to lock those, but yep, thanks for the follows. We got a poster. We have Uncle Stamps. Clap. I mean, I guess these characters are like isn't it like Elf and then something else. I don't know what the character names actually are. I feel like this would be so much cooler if I actually watched the anime first. It's kind of sad. Uh, Advent Duration looks like it's going to be for the whole month. Um, so it's going to be really easy for you guys to go ahead and get a hold of these free bonuses they're going to be giving out. And it looks like the scratch is going to last a good amount of time as well. Uh, looks like there's going to be a boost. Looks like yellow uh, yellow boost and trigger boomerang campaign. Interesting. During the trade. Uh, weakened enemies and a massive boost to experience earned. Plus, there will be once a day daily tasks where you get back the triggers you spend. So running it will give you back the triggers you spend. That's interesting. Might be time to go ahead and level up the rest of our classes. It looks like the enemy's HP is reduced by half and you earn double the experience. That's really, really nice. Yeah, they really took to uh, to changing this up. I know previously a lot of complaints were whenever the new level cap comes out, just grind PSE burst, which is boring. Well, they just made it so you don't have to grind nearly as much. Granted, it wasn't that hard to begin with. Like just doing the story got me from 70 to 74. So it's actually definitely worth it. But um, yeah, that just made that a lot easier. Uh, so Uncle in, World, uh, Uncle in Another World collaboration outfits. Uncle's uniform's not bad. I don't dislike that completely. 
it's all right, but it's not like anything amazing looking. The other outfits are pretty good. They give you guys uh, shoeless versions, which is good. It doesn't like they gave us a shoeless version of Uncle's outfit, which is kind of unfortunate, but it is what it is. Uncle's spell, Uncle's jump spell, his dash, his glide, uh, sword skills, and opening. And then a ton of the Sega stuff. Uncle's swords is something I'm actually looking forward to, you know, giving a shot. I want to get a hold of this. Uncle's glasses is pretty dope. It's pretty dope too. That's Elf's sword and God Freezing sword. Okay, cool. I do want to get Uncle's sword for sure. And then a bunch of, I'm guessing this is like creative space. I don't know why it's called BP. Is it, is that supposed to be creative space chat? Like, am I losing it? I feel like it's supposed to be creative space stuff. Usually I thought it was CS, but maybe I'm just not remembering right. Dude, the look on Uncle's face, though, actually kind of concerns me, like deeply concerns me. Build parts. BP is build parts. You guys are right. That makes a lot more sense. Thank you. All right, cool. So that's pretty much it for the um, Uncle Another World collaboration. Scratch is pretty dope. Uh, Skulls goes over these in more detail, by the way. So if you guys aren't following her channel, you definitely should. It should be linked in our channel. So if you go to the main channel, right at the top left hand side, you'll see Skulls channel. Just click on that. You'll get a link over to her channel. She covers all the fashion items in more detail, so you guys should definitely check out those videos every week. Um, and it looks like as far as event scratch or the event stuff, we've got Uncle Another World collab is starting. The AC purchase campaign is ending soon, so we'll go ahead and take a look at that. And then Exotic Summer Nights is going away, so we'll just take a quick peek at it. Now, it's not going away right now because right now is this Wednesday here, the yellow. It's basically going away after this week, so. Next week, Monday, Tuesday, and then... Wednesday it'll be gone. So let's just take a look real quick. The AC purchase campaign is this the one that's yeah, this is the one that's insane. That's like buy 12,000 AC, which people probably will now because of the Uncle Another World collaboration. Who am I kidding? I probably will as well. Um, but this is not a small amount of AC. It's pretty expensive. And then this is the exotic uh summer night stuff. Okay, cool, cool. Man, I'm kind of sad that we're not getting the other scratch yet. I think next week's scratch is the one I'm really excited for, but it is what it is. Shouldn't be a big deal though. And that's pretty much it. And that covers everything we need to know uh, post maintenance at the very least. We'll be checking out things live um, when the servers go up. We also apparently have a Dengeki article to read, so we may make that into a video separately. So keep an eye on that. For the, keep an eye out for that on the channel, if I can speak. <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, say goodbye to Twitch chat in the comments. Twitch chat, say goodbye to YouTube. Be nice to them. That way they actually join us whenever we are live and the off chances that we happen to be live. I want to recover content and new stuff. Either way, guys, like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe and keep up with more, and I'll see you all next time. Take care, everyone. Peace out.